Hey, what's up guys? Thanks for tuning into ISBJJ TV. My name is Clark and this week we're going to talk about cardio, endurance. Are you really stepping up to the next level or are you just doing what everybody else is doing? Stay tuned. Alright guys, so let's get started. Endurance, cardio is extremely important to every practitioner. And you definitely don't want to be in a match and you want to be gassed out whenever you're working out or whenever you're rolling with somebody, especially in a competition. It's extremely important that you have enough gas in the tank. And the worst thing that can happen is you know you can beat the guy or your opponent, but you just don't have enough gas in the tank. So at that point, you kind of like are out of breath, your whole body's aching, you feel the cramps in your muscles, and you're just like, man, I can't breathe. Therefore, Anything that may be a submission of a choke, I'm pr pretty much going to tap out. You don't want to be in that position. All right, so Elevation Mass 1.0. This is what it looks like. Now, yes, it does look extremely weird, and you definitely don't want to be caught running out in the night with this, but here's the benefits of the things that I like about it. Settings. You can change the settings extremely easy. You literally unscrew this and it comes in three settings, okay? Or three different colors. It comes in yellow, it comes in orange, and it also comes in red. Right? All right. The yellow one signifies that it's 6,000 feet elevation. It also comes with the orange one, which is 12,000 elevation, which is double this now. And then you get the red one. The red one is the maximum, and that's 18,000 feet of elevation. To put it on, it really is simple. You just grab the mask, grab this, screw it on, and you're pretty much done. All right, so the first thing I'm gonna do is talk about all the benefits that I like about this mask, all right? The first thing that I like about it is the fit. It fits extremely, extremely, extremely well. Whenever I put it on, there's no chance of any oxygen getting in the sides, or on the bottom, or on the top. It was, like, it's perfectly made to fit any human being's face. Second thing I love about it, the settings are extremely easy to change. You literally unscrew, boom. You grab the next color that you want to use. In this case, it'll be 12,000 feet elevation. Screw it on, boom, you're done. I, it literally takes that, that fast. Number three, it does exactly as advertised. Pretty much restricts oxygen into your lungs as you're working out. It really forces you to make the best use out of the oxygen that is in your lungs. This right here gets you mentally and physically ready for any type of activity that you're doing. It helps you learn in controlling your breath as you're running or anything you're doing. It helps you control your air intake. And it makes you use the most out of the air that you actually are putting into your lungs. Cleaning something like this is extremely easy. It comes with three wipes that you can use, and pretty much you, you wipe down the whole sides, the insides, and um, it's pretty simple to, to, to clean up. It's not a big hassle like, like any other uh, products out there, okay? Since I started using it, I did notice that I did adapt to it, and whenever I don't use it, which is rarely, but whenever I don't, running to me, I'm like, whoa. I mean, I'm able to sprint, and I'm able to run out of breath a lot less likely. Whenever I go and train jujitsu, I've noticed that I can go like eight minute rounds, pause for one minute, eight minute rounds, stop for one minute, eight minute rounds. Like I'm able to go four or five, six times until I'm starting to feel like a little bit of the of my stamina, which is great. I mean, I'm just able to go, go, go the whole match and, and it's just a beautiful thing to, to, to feel when you're rolling with somebody and you're able to just keep on going. Now, the things that I don't like about this, running at nighttime is extremely scary. Whenever I run with this thing on, I have to run like at midnight, one, two, or three o'clock in the morning, where there's really no cars out there. Uh, because if you use this when you're running out in the daytime, just in regular neighborhood, people will not know what's going on, okay? Uh, whether you're running from a bomb or if you're running from anything that's nuts okay it just doesn't look if you're running and you have a mask like this on uh people are going to assume something's going on and it might interfere with your cardio the next thing is this little socket here on the side which is meant for you to put your bottle of water into and then in the inside as you can tell uh, in the picture that i'm going to post up it has like a little straw where you can use to suck in your water or whatever I have yet to use that. I find it that if I do happen to use it, it's going to be a real pain to clean that part out. 
Okay, so that's the second part that I really don't like about it. So they're, you know, I guess they thought about it right, but um, in the end they really didn't. The third thing that I really don't like about it is the straps. I mean, I can uh, you can fix that. The straps are way too long. Like once you put this on your body, I mean, once you put this on your head, the straps are just like all over the place. Like they're like dreadlocks. You know, they're just all over the place. Really simple fix. You could just cut them and burn the tips, and then you're pretty much good to go. It does exactly what it's supposed to do. The only difference is I can't do it on public because it look weird doing it. So because of that, I'm going to rate this an eight out of ten. Now the second thing I'm going to talk about is the Elevation Mass 2.0. Now the Elevation Mass 2.0 works, I think it's a big improvement over the first version that they have. Okay, uh, The first thing that I like about it is it's extremely easy and extremely fast to put on. The other one you got to kind of put it over your head and you got to tighten up each, each of the strings and there's like two, four, five, five strings that you got to tighten up. This one there's really only one and I'll talk about the second string later. Very simple to put on. All you do is literally grab that part, put it against your face. Your ear goes through this part right here. And then in the back, you simply Velcro it closed. And you are done. Okay? Very simple to put on. The second thing that I love about this elevation mask is the actual settings are simple to put on as well. It takes a little bit longer than the first generation, but it's still extremely simple. And all you do is, for, uh, with your thumb, you just grab any of these and you just pull it off. And there you go. You change these settings, there are different settings, and I'll put the picture up there so you can see what three type of settings that they have. It has three different sizes, uh, depending on your weight. It has small, medium, and large. Now, when I ordered this, it came with something else in the inside of the package, which was this. And I just didn't understand what the heck it was or what it's used for, but now I know. If you have small ears and you put this uh, your, your ears through this if it's perfectly snug and if it's and if it's awesome however if you have bigger size ears like I do my ears are, are kind of soft and this will kind of flap over your ears sometimes and it'll push down your ears and, and it's kind of annoying so what this does is um, this is called a headband and it comes with one included if you just strap one on on each end then at that point not only do you strap it behind your neck but this one goes over your head Okay, so it definitely doesn't bother your ears and it fits a lot better that way. Another thing that I like about this, the, the Elevation Mask 2.0, is that whenever you're doing any type of workout in public, it's totally cool. It's okay. You don't look weird um, using something like this. It literally looks like you're either just, it doesn't look like anything weird. So you're pretty, perfectly fine. Whenever you have this on, you have perfect view of sight, meaning you can see left and right without having to turn your head. Whereas the first one, since you're restricted with the eye holes, you have to literally turn your whole head to see what's going on left and right. With this one, not covering your, not covering your eyes, so you're pretty much good with that. Now this version of the Elevation Mask, you can have a lot more settings in terms of altitude level. You can start off as small as 3,000 feet uh, elevation, 6,000, 9,000, 12,000, 15,000, and it goes all the way up to 18,000 as well. While using this product, it definitely does exactly what it's advertised, which is restricts oxygen to your lungs, so you're able to get a lot more workout, less of time. Now let's talk about the things that I don't like about this. When I'm using this, and I am going nuts with my workout, I tend to breathe heavier, like the vast majority of human beings do. And when I do that, I'm like <sighs> So, I'm breathing in through my nose and breathing out through my mouth. And when I breathe in through my nose, I breathe in at such force that these two uh, side parts here kind of squeeze together and they squeeze my nose closed, sort of. So when I'm trying to like, breathe in and this is squeezing my nostrils, I can't breathe in. So you're kind of forced to breathe in through your mouth and breathe out through your mouth as well. The second thing that I don't like about it is when you sweat, sweat tends to accumulate in the inside of this. And I'll show you from the pictures, there's kind of a a huge gap in here and that gap in there is what all your sweat is stuck into whenever you're like bending over or you're stretching or something like that the sweat will kind of come out through this and it will wet this material here the another thing is changing the settings are easy but they take a little bit more time than the other one you actually have to read the manual on whenever you're changing elevations like let's say you're going from 6,000 and you was and you say you know what i want to go to i don't know 15,000 elevation it's not just boom boom you actually have to read the manual because 
the inside, it depends on how you put this thing. Like if I turn this over this way, it changes the game completely. Another thing that I like about this is this is this is changeable, which is really cool because I mean, I, I'm not going to change this. I like the way this looks, but if you wanted to customize it to your own likings, you can definitely buy a different type of like mask and it's simple to take off or tape or put on. This right here, you could just buy another design. They have like Spider-Man, they have the Hulk, I think, and they have a flag. Uh, so you can buy this on their website. And this here's how the Elevation 2.0 looks without that on. And it pretty much just goes over your face. Now, my rating for this product, from a scale of 1 to 10, 10 being the best, I would have to give this product a 10 out of 10. That's right. A 10 out of 10 because it fits awesome. It does exactly what it's supposed to do. Easy to change. Comes with the manual of all the settings. And it does what it's supposed to do. So, And, and I don't look weird in public using this. So this is something that I would definitely recommend to anybody who's doing any type of uh, circuit training, any type of cardio workouts. If you incorporate this to your workouts, you will get great benefits from it. Again, consult your doctors before you try any of these things that I'm talking about. I love this product. So here's a little bit of a recap. Here's Elevation Mask 1.0, Elevation Mask 2.0. Um, they are both very inexpensive. I mean, I think they're like $89.99 for one version and the other one's like $110 or something like that or $120. I think this is the more expensive one. This is like $120, I think, or $110. For the price that you pay, it definitely takes your workouts to the next level. I definitely strongly recommend this if you're doing any type of circuit training or if you're doing any type of cardio, this will definitely take your workout to the next level and you will definitely feel it after a month if you ever go back to training your Jiu Jitsu or your MMA, you will feel a huge improvement in how much gas you have in a tank. All right guys, so that concludes today's video on the Elevation Mask 1.0 and 2.0. Um, one thing I want to let you guys know, anything that you're about to try, any supplements or products that I put out there, I'm not getting paid for any of this or I'm not getting sponsored by any of these products or companies. So I use these products. So whenever I find that they're really good, I just want to go ahead and share the knowledge to the whole world. And if you find that it might be something that suits you, go ahead and give it a shot. Before you try any supplements or any products that I recommend, please consult your doctor just to make sure it's safe for you to do. Okay. Aside from that, if you have any questions or if you feel that I left out anything about this review, please ask it down below in the comment section. Also, if you like the type of videos that I put out there, please hit the like button or subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate everybody who subscribes or all the views. I, I really appreciate it. So thank you very much, okay? Other than that, after this video, you can check me out on Twitter, Instagram, or, um, or Facebook. And I just started this Google Plus account. So if you have Google Plus, check me out on there as well. All that information will be after this video. Thank you very much for watching this video. Until next time, guys, thanks for watching. Is it recording right now? I don't know. Hmm. Yes, is it? Is it recording right now? I don't know.